Welcome to this evening devotion. We gather weekly in Lent to center ourselves and open our hearts through scripture, prayer, and song. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. God never stands far off, but is close at hand. In Christ Jesus, God draws near to us, offering grace upon grace, mercy beyond measure, and life without end. You who are troubled or in distress, you who feel separated from God's love, come to the cross where Christ receives your burdens and gives you rest. The God of hosts is with us. You who feel isolated and have experienced loss, be surrounded by God's presence. Be drawn into the family of God. Come, you who are filled with fear or anxiety, you who tremble when the earth is moved and your world begins to crumble. God is our help in trouble. You who comfort those who weep and you who wait with those near death, come to the one who is our hope and final home. God is our solace and shelter. Come, you who are burdened with pain or grief, you who are bound by guilt or shame, God is our river of mercy. You who cry out for wars to cease and violence to end, come to the one who will crush our weapons of war and turn our hearts toward peace. God alone is our defense. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When evildoers assail me to devour my flesh, my adversaries and foes, they shall stumble and fall. Though an army encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war rise up against me, yet I will be confident. One thing I asked of the Lord, that will I seek after, to live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord, and to inquire in his temple. For he will hide me in his shelter in the day of trouble. He will conceal me under the cover of his tent. He will set me high on a rock. Now my head is lifted up above my enemies all around me, and I will offer in his tent sacrifices with shouts of joy. I will sing and make melody to the Lord. Peace, be still, peace. 
Let us pray. Lord, it is night. The night is for stillness. Let us be still in the presence of God. It is night after a long day. What has been done has been done. What has not been done has not been done. Let it be. The night is dark. Let our fears of the darkness of the world and of our lives rest in you. The night is quiet. Let the quietness of your peace enfold us, all dear to us and all who have no peace. The night heralds the dawn. Let us look expectantly to a new day, new joys and new possibilities. In your name we pray, amen. 